Hello everyone, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star Star Star, and welcome to your reading. So let's see what are the urgent messages for you for the month of August. Uh, this is a general reading, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. In this reading we'll see what your uh, in this reading we'll see what is your energy, what you need to know for the month of August. What are the urgent messages that you need to know for the month of August? There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Okay? All right. So if you're interested in personal readings with me, the details of the same are in a description box and comment section. Queen of Wands. I guess, Aries, uh, you're trying to be a no-nonsense person. Okay, or at least you are trying to portray such kind of a personality. I think so. There is some sort of realization that is happening that your time, your energy is extremely valuable and no one should mess around with that. And that is what you are trying to convey. Okay, I, I also feel that you are working on something that is very, very important. And you want to dedicate your time and energy towards that. So you are really conveying to people around you that you don't have time and energy for something that might look like futile or something that is that is unimportant. Okay, because you're focusing on something that is critical, that is important for you. Okay. So what else? We have Queen of Pentacles. Yes, maybe whatever you're trying to focus it is it is uh, looks like it is related to money or it is related to work uh, you're absolutely absorbed in that you're absolutely focused on uh, certain goals or maybe there is a certain project that you are trying to work and there are certain deadlines that you want to achieve and you're working around the clock towards that okay hermit I also feel like you're strongly inclined or you will be feeling like you want to isolate yourself from the rest of the world. And this is mainly happening because of the recent experience that you have had. Uh, maybe someone was not nice to you, whether it was in a relationship or whether something at workplace might have happened. But I feel like The treatment that came your way, that treatment was certainly not something, uh, was certainly not that you deserved, okay? You got some sort of undeserving treatment. So for some of you, you might have got that treatment uh, in relationships. So it can be any, any relationship, it can be a friendship, it can be a romantic relationship, it can be, uh, it's a very broad definition, right? When I speak about relationships, it can be when something uh, you might have experienced with you with your family members as well okay so i i see that your mind is slightly disappointed and you'll feel like i want i don't want to get into socialization i i want to isolate myself or i also want to focus on a couple of things and let me isolate from things that don't matter right now yeah eight of pentacles you're certainly focusing on work you're certainly focusing on your pentacles. You're certainly focusing on how, what you can do to improve your financial situation or what you need to do to increase your income. Maybe for, uh, maybe some of you are working towards starting some alternative source of income. Okay. I think so you're doing already uh, something else right now. And apart from that, there is something new that you're going to start. So I see you will be doing at least two things in parallel when it comes to work. Ten of Swords. I got this energy with the Hermit card as well. Okay. You're planning. I'm, I'm telling you, right? So you have experienced something in the recent past which made you feel slightly disappointed. Okay. The behavior that was being... The way you were being treated... It certainly it has uh, created a dent in your mind or it has certainly created some sort of disappointment and you are you're thinking about moving away somewhere you're thinking about cutting down certain relationships or certain situations 
and ten of swords is telling me a solid end related to something and this is an initiative that has been taken by you okay nine of cups a wish is about to get fulfilled and it looks like this is more about an emotional satisfaction so this can be a wish related to your love and uh, related to love and relationships maybe you're going to meet someone knight of swords yeah you're meeting someone aries someone is in fact coming towards you you're going to meet this person very soon this person is coming towards you at a great speed by the way okay and this person you might have seen this person in the dreams but you might have not seen their face you might have seen if it's if you have seen a man you might have seen them wearing a white shirt maybe a white shirt and a black pant formals i guess okay if it's a female you might have seen her in long floral dress ace of swords someone is trying to connect with you energetically aries someone is trying to let you know that they are coming yeah someone is trying to tell you so some of you might meet this person in some educational setup if you're planning to learn something if you're planning to expand your knowledge and if you're going to enroll for some sort of classes or you're going back to school college university it's very likely that you're going to meet someone over there if that's not the case maybe you're going to meet someone at workplace there is a new beginning when it comes to love and relationship page of pentacles the fool eight of cups yeah you're walking away from couple of uh, people before you meet this right person you're rejecting some of them before you meet this right person i think so aries your soul is a very uh your soul is an awakened soul I mean you don't even have to interact with people to know whether they are a a right match for you or whether they are a right person for you the moment you see them you you kind of are able to scan their energy you are able to understand whether this person is right for you or not even from a distance that person might not even be looking at you they probably might be busy talking to someone else but your detectors are so sharp and working so fine that directly indirectly you're going to reject many people before you meet this right person before this wish fulfillment happens but you are walking away from something that is for sure apart from the romantic options there is something else that you're walking away from two of swords you probably are feeling slightly confused you might feel slightly oh my god two of pentacles again two of swords two of pentacles confusion and you probably you will seek some help before making some decision four of swords overthinking is not helping you okay you might feel slightly disheartened that you are not able to make the right choice but eventually you will make the right choice or rather this person will help you make the right choice the person who is right for you they will help you make the right choice I hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care and bye bye and if you're interested in personal readings with me the details of the same are in description box and comment section okay bye bye